welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do Nisha's favorite things, best of 2020. And basically this is all the things that I love, I use every single day, and then I 100% can recommend and stand behind as a product. Now a lot of these things are fixing to go on sale on Black Friday or they're already on sale. So make sure that you are following me on the Like to Know It app. I'm going to put it here. At Nisha Loves It, you can find the link in the description. All you have to do is click on it, download it, free app, or you can do it on your desktop as well. Everything that goes on sale, I will be posting over there, as well as on Facebook, Instagram stories, YouTube, like all the things, but it's the easiest place to find it and shop. Super easy, simple, go do it. So all of these things are 10 out of 10, Nisha recommended, Nisha approved. So here we go, let's get straight into it. We're gonna start off with some big ones. So the very first thing I'm gonna talk about is the Dyson Air Wrap. Now I just got this last week, but I've been using it and it, it does exactly what it says it's going to do. Is it expensive? Yes, that's why I'm telling you, get it on sale, use notes. You can buy uh, it from Sephora, Ulta, Dyson, Best Buy, Walmart I think even has it these days. Nordstrom has it. If you have a Nordstrom card, use your notes. If you have a Sephora card, use your notes. Save up those notes, buy them with your notes, and get them on discount. This is my hair done from yesterday with the air wrap. Um, I'll put a little video in here of me using it. I think it's pretty easy to use. It's so easy. It's so easy and fast. I did, I did this look in 30 minutes. 30 minutes last night and it still looks this good. All I did was brush it and put some hair oil in my hair. That's it, boom, that's my hair today. So I'm impressed. Yes, it is expensive. And if you're going to get one, if you're looking at the hair dryer or the air wrap, I have both. Uh, I used my Nordstrom notes to get the air wrap and then I got the hair dryer on discount from Sephora when it went on sale for 20% off. The hair dryer is amazing. If you don't wear your hair curly, then the hair dryer is fine and it's a little less expensive. But if you wear your hair curly like me, the air wrap is the way to go. Also, this is on low heat. I did it on low heat, less damage to your hair. You can read all about it on the Dyson website, why it's so expensive, the technology behind it, and how it makes your hair actually more healthy instead of less healthy. Now, another thing that's on my list but I don't use it anymore, is the Revlon One Step Hair Dryer. That's the brown brush. Now I've been, I used that for the past year. It works great and it's on sale now for $39, I think. However, that thing gets so hot. I can't even, I like, I've burned my fingers. I don't know how many times it was causing breakage on my hair and I just could not keep using it, unfortunately. But I think if you have healthy hair, then it's totally fine and it's it's a good deal and it'll give you the blown out look. Now I won't do this and it, you can't do it on low heat, but it is a good option if you don't wanna pay the amount of money that a Dyson cost. If you are gonna use that, definitely use something on your hair to protect your hair. That brings me to my next thing, Olaplex. The entire system, right now it's on sale at, Blo at Bloomingdale's uh, for $64 usually, the kit is $80, so it's a little bit marked down. I swear by it, my hair is shinier than it's ever been in my life. It's soft, I can just run my hands through it. My hair is very coarse, very frizz prone, and it's not anymore, it just looks smooth. So I swear by it, it's amazing, I love it. Well this stuff, I'll try to link everything in the description too in case you just wanna go find it right now. So let's see what's next. The next thing is a beauty tool. So I've talked about this for years and I still maintain that it is worth the money. It is the Bio Beauty Micro Needling Kit and it is also on sale right now. You can find it linked in the description like everything else. Um, the price on it right now is if you use Glow 30 discount code and I'll put all that in the description as well as well as over on my blog and the Like to Know It app. Easy, easy. I'm going to make this as easy as possible for you guys to find this stuff at the lowest price possible. So 30% off the entire kit and you can just buy the face one, but I do recommend you get the whole kit because it's just the, you get the most bang for your buck. So I'll show you what mine looks like in the picture over here. And it comes with the face roller and then also it comes with the neck to do like your neck and your chest as well. Uh, and the cleaning thing, a spray bottle for you to clean it with and stuff like that. I love this thing. I use it every week. 
it if you want to know exactly how it works i can do a whole review on that and the air wrap if you want to if you want to review on any of these products individually let me know in the comments basically that's that's what i've been using for the past four years to fight wrinkles pore size um discoloration all of that stuff i use it literally i've been using this product for years <laughs> and i swear by it so to go along with that, I do recommend that you use a hyaluronic acid. The um, Tarte makes a really good one. It's called Mermaid Skin, but you can find it at a local day spa or if you have a local spa near, spa near you, they make that usually. I buy mine from the spa who does my brows. She, It's very strong and it's so good. Hyalur hyaluronic acid is like the fountain of youth for your skin. Use it every single day. It's, it's so good. Your skin will thank you. It is what I use every day it's basically the number one product i use for skincare across the board and that's what i've been using for the past three four years um okay so the next one is the foundation i used to use Too faced foundation i swore by it it's what i used for forever this year young living came out with foundation liquid foundation they did have powder and it was okay but i didn't love it the liquid foundation is so good it's what i'm wearing right now it's what i wear every single day i also use the mineral veil which kind of gives me a little bit of a glow i love it it only takes a little they have uh, a pretty good range of colors and they'll probably add some more in the coming years uh i i love it i can't believe how good it is it's not a whole lot of coverage but it still you know evens out skin tone and everything like that that you want but it doesn't look super cakey and i just I, I was blown away because I didn't really like any of the other powder foundations, but this one is really good. So if you're not already a member from Young Living, I have a whole video. I'll link it uh, up here for you guys. You can go watch it. How to join Young Living. You never have to sell anything. You don't have to buy monthly. All of that is a huge myth. You don't have to do that. Uh, you can sign up with me. I'll never bug you. I don't care. And you can buy what you want as you want. The only thing Young Living requires is that you order $50 per year or 50 PV, which usually equals out to $50. That's it. That's the only catch. Order $50 worth. And if you're getting your foundation and concealer, that's going to be $50. So if you want to sign up, there's a kit. There's a starter kit that's $35 and then you can add on the foundation or you can get the whole box of oils and the diffuser, which I use every day as well, but you don't have to do that. You can just get the basic starter kit and buy the foundation. I'll have all that information linked in the description and over on my blog as well, if anyone's interested. But seriously, the foundation is so good and I do use oils every day. The next thing is my lips. Um, this is Kylie Jenner Lip uh, Velvet Matte Lip, I think is what it's called, in the color Candy K. It's what I'll use every single day is the only color I ever wear. It's my ride or die. It looks good when I'm casual. It looks good when I'm dressy and it doesn't dry my lips out. I really, really like it. I think it's a great color and it goes on so smooth. I think it makes my lips look bigger too, but that could just be all in my head. Lash serum, lash serum. Okay, I get asked all the time if I have lash extensions, are you wearing falsies? No, these are my lashes. All I do is use a lash serum. Now there's two different serums and both will be linked. One is um, Lash MD and the other is Great Lash, I think. The only difference is one's a little bit pricier. I have used both. Honestly, I think they work exactly the same. So go with the cheaper one, which is Lash MD. You can find that at Sephora, Ulta. I'll have it linked in the description. Sometimes at the holidays, they'll have a gift set. So if they do have a gift set, I will be posting that on the Like to Know It app. So if that's something you're interested in, make sure you follow me. I know I'm sounding like a broken record, but seriously, it's the easiest way to find cheap stuff. And I do go out of my way to find the least expensive version of the things that I use. Some of these are a little pricier. Sometimes you get what you pay for. Also, uh, while I'm on the lashes, I have linked my mascara and the, lip, the lash primer that I use. It's from Walmart. It's L'Oreal and it comes in a duo. So you get the primer and the mascara. It's what I've been using for a year. Absolutely love it. It looks great on my lashes and it's super inexpensive. The next thing is a vinyl record player. Now I've had my record player for years, but I find that people ask me about it all the time. So I wanted to talk about it real quick. I got mine from Urban Outfitters. Now vinyl record players, they're not all created equal, okay? Like you're gonna get what you pay for when it comes to a vinyl record player. They will break if they are made cheaply. 
They will, and it'll be a waste of your money. The one I have is, like I said, from Urban Outfitters. I think it's a hundred and something dollars. It's beautiful and ornate. You can get them all different colors, shapes, and sizes from there. And I can tell you, I've had mine for almost four years, maybe five years. I've never had any problems out of it. It plays exactly the way that it should. It looks good. It sounds good. And I love vinyl records. I just got Dolly's new album and I've been playing it on there. So if you're into vinyl records and music in general, I love a vinyl record player. I think it, it looks pretty sitting out and, the, and it's just, you know, it's nostalgic. So I recommend the one I got from Urban Outfitters because I can stand behind the fact that that thing has moved with us three different times and it's, it's never skipped a beat. It's never done anything that it shouldn't do. It plays perfectly and I absolutely love it. A wet brush. So I talked about a wet brush when I was doing the hair dryer, the Dyson hair dryer um, demo. And some of you didn't know what a wet brush is. So a wet brush is just, it's the, you can get it at Walmart and it just means that the bristles are soft and bendy so that when you brush your hair, when you have it wet and you're putting in your leave-in conditioner, you can brush through your hair and it doesn't break your hair off. Super cheap. You can get expensive ones, but the ones from Walmart are totally fine and work great. Uh, I've had mine for a long time, so I just bought a new one from Ulta that has Ariel on it. I just thought it was cute, but like I said, you can get cheaper ones at Walmart and they work great, but they're awesome. If you have curly hair, frizzy hair, put that leave-in conditioner in, use your wet brush to brush it in and make sure it gets everywhere. It really, really helps. St. Tropez. I get asked all the time about what kind of self-tanner I use. St. Tropez is the only brand that I have found that works the way that it's supposed to, doesn't streak, is easy to put on, doesn't smell really bad, and gives you a nice color. Now there's three different ones that I use. There's the blue bottle, which is St. Tropez Express. That one you can leave on for an hour, two hours, three hours, depending on how dark you want it and wash it off. It develops really quickly and the color is beautiful. The second is the gel. Now it has a more subtle natural look to it. It's not as dark, but it still gives you a nice color. And then the face mist, I use it every day. It actually also has hyaluronic acid in it, so it's good for your skin, but also gives you a nice glow. It's not super, super dark. It looks very natural, or I think that it does. These LED battery candles that I got from Amazon, I bought them, I wanna say two years ago from a recommendation on YouTube. And they're awesome. They're amazing. I think they're a steal. It comes with several candles. I'll put everything right here. And not only are they cute, all right, they last a long time. They come with a remote. You can have different settings. So you can have just on, you can do flicker. It has a timer. You can set the different, if you want it bright or darker. Uh, and, and it's, they're just fantastic. I think they are probably the best LED candles that I've ever gotten. And the timer keeps the battery from going dead. So I think there's a four hour, a six hour, an eight hour, and you just hit that. And after so much, after so many hours, you know, have gone, it'll turn itself off, save the battery. So you want them to come on at five and go off at 12. That's what's going to happen. And so then the next day at five o'clock, they come back on just in time for the sun to set. Like how cool is that? So I really love them. I think they're still Amazon find one of my top things. My Ugg sneakers. Okay, guys, I know I've talked about these over and over and over again, but it's because they really are <laughs> the best shoe ever. They are cute. They are comfy. They have fur on the inside, so they're nice and warm. They look really good with jeans and just a normal little sweater. You can dress them up, you can dress them down, you can wear them with leggings, you can wear them with jeans, like it doesn't matter. They're awesome, true to size. And seriously, I wear them nine out of 10 days. That's how much I love these shoes. I, if I, if they start to fall apart, which they haven't, and I've literally been wearing them almost every single day, I will get another pair. That's how much I like them. Thank you, Ugg. Because, I mean, okay, I think Uggs are like, not as cute as they used to be, but these, they're a sneaker, and they're just, I don't know. They're so cute. I absolutely love them, and I think you will too. Spanx leggings. I've talked about these for years too, but because they're that good they really are that good i've had the same pair of spanx leggings for four years they have not stretched out they do not look worn out they don't look 
old. They look brand new. They still fit me and they suck everything in. Not that I have a lot to suck in anymore, but when I did, <laughs> they sucked everything in. And you can, like I said, dressy or casual. They go really good with the sneakers. I think that they're 100% worth the price. You can have 10 pair of leggings from Walmart and they're not gonna last you very long. Or you can have one pair of Spanx leggings and they're going to last you. At this point, they've lasted me almost five years and that's, I mean, I wear them a lot, a lot. So they will go on sale on Black Friday. If you follow me on the Like to Know It app, you will see when they go on sale and be able to shop those. They will sell out, I promise you. They do every year. There's a reason why those things are so popular. Native deodorant. Okay, deodorant's kind of a weird thing to talk about, but I am not 100% chemical free, okay? I'm a human and I got things in my house that aren't 100% chemical free. But deodorant is something that I make a 100% effort to have non-chemical deodorant. And I've tried all kinds of kinds, all kinds of kinds, Young Living, the Kopai, like all of them, none of them did what I needed them to do, Native does. And I 100% stand behind that product. I've been using it for two or two years, I would say. Before that, I was using whatever brand that didn't have aluminum and parabens and phthalates, phthalates, however you pronounce it, all that stuff. It's very important. You're putting it on your underarm. All of your lymph nodes are here. Like It's important to not use crappy deodorant. Uh, I can use it once in the morning and I'm, I'm good all day long. Now, overnight, I sweat, and then when I wake up, I need a shower, but we're all taking a shower in the morning, aren't we? It does get me through the day, which is what I need. It smells good. There's so many different scents. I like the coconut one best myself. Dr. Berry uses the charcoal one. It's great. We also use the bar soap. So good. They have it at Target, they have it at Walmart. You can order it online, you can get a subscription. I think you get a discount if you order a subscription. It's a little bit more expensive than Secret, but it's safe for you, so I think that that's worth it. My sound machine, okay? This sound machine is insane. So we bought this last year and we've been using it ever since because the baby, we wanted to have pink noise, white noise, all that stuff. It has a bunch of different noises, but that's not what's the selling point, okay? It has what I think it's called adaptive and it's just a button you hit. And when things get louder, the noise machine gets louder. So at night, when Dr. Barry goes <laughs> the sound machine gets louder with him so I don't actually hear him snoring and it doesn't wake me up. How insane is that? Also for the baby, if I'm doing something while he's napping and I drop something, the sound will get louder and drown out whatever I'm doing. It's a little expensive, 100% worth every single penny ever. It's, it's the best thing ever. Um, the next thing is my alarm clock and it's one of the sunrise alarm clocks. What happens is you set it for whatever time you want to get up and about 30 minutes prior to the alarm going off, it starts to glow and it just gets brighter and brighter and brighter until the whole room is filled with natural light and it naturally wakes you up. You can also have sound play, but it's a really nice way to wake up that's not like rah, rah, rah. No, that's not a good way. You need to ease yourself into waking up and you're gonna feel better. Like the way I used to wake up versus how I wake up with this alarm clock, it's so much better. Of course, sometimes Beck gets my alarm clock and the, you know, it is what it is, but this, I really like it and I like how it eases you into being awake. So I, like I said, all of these things will be linked in the description. You can go to my blog or you can follow me on the Like to Know It app for the easiest way to find these things at the best price that I can find. My coffee maker is an Espresso Virtual Plus. They did just come out with a new one. I think it's on sale. Mine is also on sale. The newer one has a few cool features. I would like to have it, but I have only had mine for a few years. So I'm not going to buy the new one. I don't need it, but I really want it. But So the new one I would totally go for. I think it's going to be amazing. I love it. We order our pods from the Nespresso website. We have a subscription. So every month we get a box of coffee. You can go up, you can go down, you can order as little or as much as you want, different flavors. They have seasonal flavors. It's great coffee. 
I 100% love it. it. Comes, It's not in plastic cups like the K-Cups. It's in aluminum cups. They're recyclable. All around a really, really good tasting quality coffee. I don't even miss Starbucks. I barely go to Starbucks anymore unless I'm just out and I'm going by there anyways. I 100% rather have my coffee at home. And last but not least, my air fryer. Uh, I do have the Cuisine Art air fryer with the digital screen. It does a lot of different stuff. It has a lot of different functions. It's easy to clean. I had people tell me that it's really hard to clean. It's not. I've not had any issues cleaning it. It's super easy. I just wipe it down and then I'm done. Like it's super easy to clean. I don't know why I got told that so much. I've not had any issues with it. I've had it for I don't know, six months ish and I use it all the time for sausage, bacon, you can do wings in there. There's all kinds of air fryer recipes. I think Maria Emmerich has an entire book dedicated to air fryer recipes. It's great for people who are eating keto. So air fryer, I love it. I am, oh, I really was not sold on it. I thought it was one of those things that people were talking about, but really it was just another gadget that no one needed. No, I use it every single day and I love it. And mine's on sale right now for 50, 40% off. I think it's 40% off. Like I said, everything will be linked in the description on my blog and in the like to know it app. So make sure you check all that out for the best bang for your buck. Cause I'm really hunting down the deals for you guys. So I really, really, really want you guys to get the best bang for your buck. All right guys, whew. I tried to really go fast, but this, I know it took a minute. So I hope this video was informative and helped you out. If it was, make sure you smash that thumb button, hit the subscribe button for more videos just like this coming up in the holidays. I'm doing Vlogmas, a video every day, recipes, all that good stuff. So if you wanna hang out with me some more, watch these videos over here and hit that subscribe button below and I'll see you in the next video. Love you, mean it, bye.